Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. So guys, today I create really cool and beautiful abstract shape design in Cinema 4D. So firstly guys, I take cylinder and change some settings. So I go to object and radius. I take 2 cm and I increase height. Height I take like 600 cm. Yes. Guys, closer. Right. And now I go to display, select God shading lines. Yes. Guys, I increase height segments. This one, increase. Like I take like 300. Yes. Yeah, 300 is good. Also, guys, increase rotation segments little bit like 50. Yeah. See, guys, that's my cylinder shape. Right. Okay. So now, guys, this time I take cloner. So I go to MoGraph and use cloner. This one. Yes. Guys, select this cloner. Actually, cylinder and make chat with cloner. Yeah. And now, guys, go to here. Cloner and change mode. I take object, right? Object and guys, this time I create object. So I take disk, this one. Yeah, guys, same. Change some settings like inner radius. I take like 20 and outer radius decrease. I take like 25. Yeah. And guys, decrease these segments. This segments I take one and rotation segment is good. Yeah, see guys, that's my object shape. Right? Okay, so guys, select this cloner and drag and drop in object disk. Yeah, great. See guys, that's my simple shape. Okay, so guys, go to transform and R dot P rotation, I take minus actually 90 degree. Yes, 90 degree. And guys, but guys, that's not correct. So fix this. So I again, I go to object and distribution type. I use vertex, this one. Yeah. So hide lines. Yes. See guys. That's my cylinders. Yeah. Okay. So guys, this time now I create rotation and band animation. So I take null object. This one. Select only cylinder. Actually cloner. And make chat with null. Yeah. So guys, I take twist tool. So select this twist and make chat with null. Yes, yeah, see guys, that's my layer. So guys, select this twist tool and change some settings. Same. Guys, size, I take like 50 centimeter. And Y axis, I take same, 600. And last one, I take 50. Yes, right? Okay, so guys, increase angle. Angle, I take like 480. Actually, 720. Yes. See, guys. That's my rotation twist. So, closer. See, guys. Right? That's my shape. Okay. So, guys. Now, I create rotation effect. So, I take band tool. Same. Select this band and make child with null. Yes. Guys, size. I take same. Select this band. And size, I take 50, 50 and 600 and 50. Yeah. Okay. So, guys, strength, this one increased only 360. Yeah. See, guys, that's my shape. Right? It's so easy, guys. That's so easy. Okay. So, guys, hide this disk. Hide and hide on render. Yes, and again I take null object and guys select all null object and disk and connect with null object one. Yeah, 
so guys select this null and i go to front view panel guys change this center pivot this one go on mate so click on here enable access check and go to in mid like this yes right and enable and check so go to here yes and mid yes right guys that's my shape i show you see guys right that's really good okay so guys now i create one more shape so select this null one and copy press control c and v so i select this null and i go to chord and size i take 0.5 all size 0.5 yes that's great right okay so guys now delete this null so guys i apply material so i go to create and load material select and open guys i create random effect color so uncheck unlock all so select this selector and press copy the shortcut command is control key press control key drag and drop yeah select both more yes right so apply one by one like this yellow and guys purple guys one more time and copy this time i apply like blue yes right guys that's really good it's really colorful guys you can apply more yes that's much better okay so guys now i apply c4d light so i go to file and merge select and open and press close key yes guys flow and background is good now select this null one and up more yes yeah right okay so guys now i take camera and camera check guys select this camera and all rotation i take 0 and 0 position 0 and y axis i take like 150 and minus 600 yes see guys that's my shape right see okay so guys that's it so now i create one more shape so select this null one and press copy press control c and v yes guys select this null and same chord size 0.5 0.5 and 0.5 yes right guys that's my shape so closer yeah right okay so guys again i go to camera and guys camera angle lock so cam select this camera and right click on camera select c4d target actually c4d tags and i take protection this one yeah Okay so guys that's it last one set overhead chop box select this overhead chop box go to in mid yes and again go to camera yeah guys i create only one frame so i take best render setting ambient occlusion 256 accuracy i take 100% this one and global illumination in directly catch i take low and anti select best right so close and render and press okay right guys so guys that's it it's my simple abstract shape beautiful abstract shape animation actually this is effect so it's finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download this project file and materials from my website is free thank you